He spent years on Arizona's death row for a murder he did not commit. Now, 10 years after being set free and moving home to Pennsylvania, Ray Crone is back in Arizona telling his story. 3TV's Stacy Delicat sat down with him to talk about how he's been able to move on. Stacy? Well, Fields, this Sunday marks 10 years from the day Ray Crone was exonerated by an Arizona judge after spending a decade behind bars, three of those years in isolation on death row for a murder he did not commit. He says rather than being angry about the years he lost behind bars, he's trying to turn his experience into something positive. Within one day of getting up on a Sunday, Tuesday evening, I'm in jail, and for the next 10 years, I'm uh, in prison facing the death sentence. Ray Crone was convicted twice for the murder of 26 year old Kim Ancona at a Phoenix bar in 1991. All along, he maintained he was home the night of the murder, something his roommate even corroborated. Still, prosecutors convinced two juries that bite marks found on the victim matched Crone's teeth. But in 2002, he was exonerated by DNA evidence. If they can do it to me, they can do it to anybody. Crone spent nearly three years on death row and now has made it his mission to help others who have been wrongly convicted. He tours the country talking about the death penalty, something he used to support. I've never met a person that's wise enough. Uh, experienced enough to determine who should live and who should die without making mistakes. Yesterday, Arizona carried out its third execution of the year of Thomas Kemp, convicted of a 1992 murder. His last words, that he regretted nothing. Attorney General Tom Horn said Kemp has paid the penalty for his terrible crimes. It is my hope that his victims and their families will find some measure of peace, that justice has been carried out. But Crone believes the death penalty is not the harshest punishment. A lot of people would think the death penalty is the ultimate punishment, make them suffer, killing them is the best thing. Um, I lived on death row with these, I was on death row for three years. You know, uh, I'll tell you what, with our, most of all our opinion was, kill me, do me a favor. What have we proven to society that this is actually now making it safer, a better society? Has it worked? Does it work? Crone is speaking at a legal conference about wrongful convictions at the Phoenix School of Law tomorrow.